Hello everybody and welcome to another Boundary Break video. Today we are taking a look at Cathcart Circle Line. Uh, this is the last British route I need to do now in terms of Boundary Break until West Cornwall comes out. So without further ado, let's enable the camera. There we go, we've now enabled the camera. We are at Glasgow Central Railway Station here. So we're going to have a good look around. And there's only something I've spotted. There's um, one of my trains, uh, my Northern Rail um, 150 here, that I did the other, the other week in, on the, in the tutorial video. Here it is. It's a long way from home. It's very, very lost. So, right, yeah, where was I? Right, here we go. This is Glasgow Central Railway Station. Now, there is an invisible wall around here somewhere. You can't, you can't actually get up this far. But let's go down here. And we've now exited the station. So this is the outside of Glasgow Central Station. This is the city of Glasgow. So we'll come back into the station. So there you go, we've got a train leaving there already. Please ensure you have a ballot ticket. That one's going out shortly. You will be expected to produce your tickets when asked. So let's just go underneath the platform. Oh, we can't go underneath there. Then we've got the other side of the station here. The escalators that lead to literally nowhere. So I think these stops here, these platforms here, I think they are used for the intercity services like Transpennine, Cross Country, etc. etc. So it's quite real life this would this would be a busy station in real life. And obviously it's rather quiet. So we'll start off by going over here. We've got the bridges here. I don't know what bridge that is in Glasgow, but we've got the bridge look under the water. Oh, there's nothing under the water yet that I can see. No hidden tables. But this is the bridges as you come across from Glasgow Railway Station. There's one of the little flexibles there. Then you got the casino here. And then the line stretches out far down there. And this because it's got two branch lines, we probably there probably will be a little bit, little bit of repetitiveness. Um, that I can't that I can't help. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this line first round here. There's actually something up to show you. Um, people make Glasgow. And then we come to, oh, what's this over here? Wholesale. Wholesale warehouse there. I don't think we've missed a stop. Nope, not yet. I don't think we're at a stop yet. We'll go underneath the tunnel. I think I've just, ah, I've come round the wrong tunnel. Because this is the main line. That's the yeah. That is the main line. Ah, yes. Here we go. Now I've got the bird. Now I've got a bird's eye view of the route. That's the main line. We go down around here. There's also another line there that joins the main line as well, which we don't really use. And our first stop should be Pollock Shields. Pollock Shields East. So this is Pollock Shields East railway station. This is what's practically basically above it. And obviously that sees a ring that 
that's the I think that's the other ring that goes round it because it goes round in like um, a circle the Cathcart circle which we'll come back round onto that because we're going to go this way oh there's a mosque there's a mosque there there's another track that leads on to the main line and then we go through here to our next station which is Queen's Park and then this is what is above the track the next one is Cross Hill Look at that old football field there, church. So it's quite um, an urban route into a in, into city route, as in when I say when I say city, I don't mean as in between cities. I mean actually inside the city, it's an urban kind of route. Um, we're at Mount Florida. And then we've got some flats around here, like a round a random roundabout there. Lots of trees in the distance. Then we can branch off around here towards, I think it's Newton. Yep, and we're at Kings Park Station now. We're going out into the suburbs now. Croftfoot. Then obviously it's got a little underground passage here. You can walk down to the houses and shabam, here's the houses. This actually looks quite nice. It, this route is probably one of the best scenic routes there is. Well, into urban anyway. Oh, grass again. I know I, I'm a tart for grass. I'm a vegetation whore. And the ballast is also a mod as well. You should have by now I use mods on everything. And this station is Burnside. Yeah, and we have a underground section here, then we have like some little shops here. The Russian shop. This stop here is Kirkhill. This is what is above Kirkhill Station. You got some litter bins here, and some more houses around here. Then we go into a tunnel, but we all know what tunnels look like, so we'll go over the top of the tunnel. And again, all you can see is houses here. Now, I think this is the one where the alien spaceship is crash landed. Oh, and there's the main line. I think it's finally caught back up with us. I was going to go and have a look down this main line. I think this is the same main line. As early, oh no, it's, it's only two track lengths. But yeah, I think that is the main line. Or at least part of the main line. Because when we run up onto the main line, we have a we have a station here. Which is, oh, Newton. So it's Neilston, not Newton, where the thingy is. 
This is Newton railway station, where the, the track then branches off down here. It's the forest. It's the little forest here, and then you've got another track that goes down there. Now we're going to head towards Neilston now. You can go back the other way. Ah yes, that's where we came, yeah. Since we get an overview of the map. Just zoom out a little bit more. The circle is up there. Because Glasgow Station is Glasgow Station's over there. And also this is the whole route. And also there is we're coming all up along here. So we've already been on some of this. I think let's check this station here, see what station is. Burnside, yes, we have. So we're now going to go towards Neilston. We'll stop at the station here, that's that's Cathcart. That's Cathcart. Just need to um stop my zoom from being silly. Because we look Now, this is Mir End. I probably completely butchered that. It's a little wet, kind of marsh, marshy area there. We are going to come back onto. We're going to come back down this section in a short bit once we've done to Neilston again. So it's William Wood. It's William Wood from the air. And now we're coming up to um, where the alien spaceship is. White Critics. I wonder if they come to take Nicola Sturgeon home. That is literally just a scenery tile. So I, I, I bet I could remove that. Well, I probably can remove it and just have to default one back and it'll probably just... There's other grass there. Yep. This cow was there. And we've got like a little boating lake here. Unfortunately, there is nothing hidden underneath it. That's a shame. And then we continue on our travels. It's like a broken pipe. Then we get some nice new houses here. New, nice new built houses. Right behind the railway track. So I suppose in real life you'd have like a lovely view of the railway. You'd be able to hear the trains. This station is Patterton. Train's going to go shortly. She's leaving the passengers behind. <laughs> I 
Um, your passengers have fallen out of the train, love. They're currently sat on the tracks. Then, out into the countryside, we've got some massive lake here, massive lock. I don't know what lock it is. Some ducks and some geese squawking. Looks like this is an overflow for the rest of the but that list of lakes waters. There's quite a lot of lakes here. This is quite a deep lake. Then we have another lake here. Some construction works going on over there. Oh, there's another rail train. Some houses and a little bit of forestry over there. Chief just jumped back down again. And then we come to at last Nielston. And then, see, so that's the end there where you change track. And there's then yeah, nothing at the end. So I'm just going to zoom back up. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's not let me to zoom back out. The ground fog is being weird. There's that weird glitch when it's far away though. Get used to, oh wait a minute, I think that Yeah, it's just probably normal. I wonder if these passengers are still on the platform round here. Oh no, they've gone now. Probably died. Probably got run over by a train and died. Oh well, probably just despawned. There is no death in video games. Right, and then here is the Cathcart Circle. So we can come around in this massive circle here. So this is the circle part of the route. This is Langside. This is Pollock Shores. Pollock Shores East. This is Shorelands. And then we have Maxwell Park here. Which I believe is where the football ground is. Another lake over there. Some tennis pitches. Pollock, sh Pollock Shields West. In the line, there's a track that goes a little bit down here, which then leads to nowhere. And obviously, there's that railway station there, which is Pollock, Shield, Pollock Shields East. Then head back around here, which I believe is towards the depot. Up here is the Scott Rail Depot. And then the main lines disappeared off down to there. So, guys, thank you for watching. For, thank you for watching this episode of Boundary Break. Next week's Boundary Break, it might possibly be Boston Sprinter. I've not decided yet. But stay tuned. Remember to comment and subscribe. I'm Yorkshire Lad, and I will see you in the next one.